Um, okay, uh, I want to complain because I don't want to consider this to be exposing or the truth or anything like that. I'm just complaining, okay? Uh, the most heavily shadow banned group of, or, or it's a small, it's not really a large group, but it's, if you want to say heavily shadow banned, like as in out of a hundred detransitioned uh, um, transmissions, the, uh, none of them are going to be, they're all going to get shadow banned on YouTube. And, and I'm not encouraging people who have transitioned their sexuality to go back to their original sexuality. I'm not saying that you have to go back. I, like, I don't, I don't know what is right for somebody. Okay. Um, but I do know that, uh, a lot of the feminists are, they're like confused why more women can't leave the ho the, the household or something. They're like confused, like uh, they kind of want to lay like, a, like a, they kind of want to beat, the, beat the, the trail, you know, where there's no avenue, you know, for more women to become independent. And I don't know, like, shouldn't you just focus on your own relationships? Because I can't really figure out other people's relationships. There's some things in the other people's relationships that even if they're fighting and one of them looks like they're abusing the other one and you stepped in, you're gonna you're lined up to get abused by both of them. So, and, and it doesn't even have to be all like that. Like, uh questioning why isn't there more you know or trying it's like it's like trying to say that you're in a relationship because you settled or something like this just be careful about when you place certain particular words that could be considered it in inconsiderate you might hurt somebody's feeling Wait until, because if you have the fourth width of self-determination to want to leave a relationship, you can do it. And then after that, like, why, like, why would you stick around just to torment somebody who doesn't know that you even interested in, in the agenda behind the relationship in the first place? Why did you get together in the first place? As long as you're trying to accomplish the same thing. And you're both encouraged and and um, and uh, pushed in a healthy sense of competitive, com comp you, like it's a healthy competition. You're trying to trying to figure out the best means to put somebody together, complete, completely. So it's like I know I I know the thing about like um, hard men create good times, good times create soft men and so, and weak and weak men create terrible harm times and everything like i get that but you don't know that your son or or if you give if if you clear the path for some of the obstructions in your way for them you don't know that they won't appreciate it you don't know that they won't um uh have reverence for 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 that and that they won't be softened by it that they won't um snap at the opportunity if they won't recognize the contribution you don't know that they won't do any of those things either that's the reason why you still has to do it even though you understand that it was it was a uh, hard man that created the good times okay there's just no guarantee but you still has to do what you have to do It, it it doesn't make sense the arbiter like okay they want to be arbiters but they're completely arbitrary if you notice the politicians will speak indirectly about issues and and they will deflect arbitrarily
okay so this just comes to a point to when you got to shit or get off the pot that's why they have this con this term of constipated bureaucrats okay forget about what the pope was talking about and the mainstream media was talking about coprophagia and all this kind of stuff they were like trying to point the finger at trump because he said shithole okay but you were the first one to tell people to go back to the urban dictionary okay that's not something that a that a clergy is you you know what i'm saying like clergy you're okay if you smoke and cuss you can still be a good priest you can still be a good but it's like there's some of the are bought off and then their whole motif is worried about like whether or not somebody ever did drugs before and you can't ever listen to it anything they have to say you can you can never platform somebody who ever detransitioned but you can still encourage them to transition but you can't and see the thing is i'm i'm not encouraging anybody to detransition i just i just think that i just i actually i just hope that that family unit sticks together i don't know why if that's not even necessary anymore because we're so we have become acumen have become evolved or whatever but i still don't i still don't see why that's a problem though and the feminists are just constant they're just like they don't understand why more families don't just doesn't split up like who the f how the hell did you get programmed like this how the hell did you program like that despite whether or not there's any factual evidence that you can say that I can recite or fucking cite. I just kind of feel the shit out. I just kind of seem like hey, you don't seem like like you, you're kind of like peaked. You're kind of like uh, what's that? Um, fickle. I sound like a, a hyper, almost a hyper, either you're a hypochondriac or you're just the gene pool did not help you out by making you immune to certain bullshit you know did you know that the um covid test is actually a h1n1 swine flu test that these scientists can't even talk about transmission because their best uh an, um assertion about how uh the 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 uh pathogen was was com you know commutable and then communable just means that you you can have you know somebody can dump cocaine on you and you can have cocaine on your head and your shoulders but you don't snort how is the how is this shit transmissible and they said it was through radiation okay radiation is qualifiable as either heat light or the chemical compound radium we know that it's a uh, covid is a chain of proteins that is not a complete like similar to a dyson sphere has to be a complete with a cell mass even though it's a chain of proteins doesn't mean that it has any cell mass can you please tell some people about that before they put on this mask that doesn't even fucking filter to, to shit through and then they're pulling germs on their face and they can go back and find the germs that they were pulling and put it back on their face or leave it all strewn out and if i can't get into the store i'll pick a dirty mask off the garbage can and put it on backwards it doesn't have the cooties on it but on the other side it's supposed to have is a, a a pathogen with no cell mass almost like light as a neutrino like something that can pass through your body that is emitted by the sun or something like it's a little bigger than that pheromones are a little bigger than that but there's not going to be able to be caught by a fucking a mask blind leading the blind and fucking for a reason then it's co it's some consumeristic reason then for you to tell somebody else here's your mask when you don't even know that they came with the mask and they can't chill and they can't come into the establishment here's your mask you fucking can you just offer somebody a mask without presenting it as my own already owned it can you do that Cause you're a fucking half of a molester.
And they programmed all the front of the house staff to tell the customer bases not to patronize them about this issue. How are you gonna make any money? How are you gonna conduct any business? You're supposed to have the opposite, I, the opposite thing. Come in, it's hospitality. We're looking out for your well-being and while you're inside of our establishment, nothing harm could ever come to you. That's called hospitality. So they fucked it up for all the all the merchant class. You're not getting tough doing that. You're a constipated bureaucrat. You need to shit, get off the pot. You're not hungry. You're trying to act like you're hungry. Okay.